Hi, I'm Moto. Welcome to my kitchen. I will teach you how to cook Japanese food in a very easy way and also my original way. Today we're making tamagoyaki. So, tamagoyaki or egg omelette is a very stereotypical Japanese food.、Uh, you can find it in sushi sometimes, or you can find it on a side dish, on a bento box, or in many places. So, the ingredients i s egg. So, first, let's crack eggs. I'm using today five eggs. And you want to flavor the egg, and I add Sugar. I like sweet, so I put like about a, a tablespoon and a half, and then a dash of soy sauce, and another dash of salt. And then my secret ingredients for、uh, my egg omelette is mayo, specifically the Japanese Kewpie mayo. This is very versatile, you can drink it, you can eat it as is. And, or you can put it on salad, you know, you can use this for everything. And、um, this mayo, I just squeeze about a tablespoon or so in, and you mix them together. So you want to mix this really well, and all the mayo and、um, sugar and other stuff are incorporated well. And now, You、turn the heat on, and once it,、uh, the pan gets heated up,、uh, we will start cooking. And I'm using regular round、uh, frying pan instead of、uh, in Japan,、um, every family owns a tamagoyaki pan or this、uh, specifically rectangular shaped pan, ideal to make a perfect、um, square tamagoyaki. Okay, so you heat up the pan, and you, you want to keep it like medium to medium high, you don't want it too low. And you pour a little bit of oil. On here, and、um, you want to sort of like spread it evenly using a paper towel. And now you pour a first batch, just about this much, and then you kind of spread it around all over the pan. And first layer, you just want to. Create a base so that you can keep rolling. So you kind of gather it together to your,、uh, your near side. And then this is also important. It really、um, uh, needs to be a very smooth surface, otherwise, egg will stick to the, the pan. So you again pour just about the same amount. And then from this layer, try to go straight like this line. Straight and this line straight rather than like go all the way along the side of the pan. That's the that's the trick to make a somewhat like good shape、um, uh, egg roll. And now you keep rolling this. So this is the second layer. Again, another bit of oil. Egg. Spread it. Try to be straight edge. And then roll it, roll it, roll it. And you basically continue this process until all the batter is gone. You know, little empty spot, don't worry about it. It's not a big deal. I think the important part is to keep the pan always hot so that the, the egg doesn't stick to the pan. 
and then when you start feeling like you know batter may be sticking to the bottom, apply this oil soaked、um, paper towel. And then once the batter becomes like you know maybe you have once or two more layers of、uh, egg, this is when you need to be a little bit more careful than、um, before. Let's say I'm just gonna finish off with this layer. You put a little bit more than、um, what you did before, so that make sure every you have a, a thicker coat on this layer, and then you put extra caution not to like break and roll it up. So this becomes the final layer, and now this is still a little bit too pale. So I will、um, continue、um, cooking a bit and to add a little bit more color. And this is tamagoyaki done. So you just wanna to serve, cut off the edges. You just hide those like ugly part. And then you cut it.、Um, you can cut it either just like regular, just all the way straight down, or you can also like angle it to make a wider surface. And then you just plate it like so, and serve it as is. So this is tamagoyaki or egg omelet. Enjoy. Stay tuned for next episode where I am making tonkatsu or breaded deep-fried pork, Japanese favorite dish. <laughs>